morning students, teachers and parents. Welcome to our final virtual assembly for the semester. Please welcome Zoe and David for the acknowledgement of country. I would like to respectfully acknowledge the traditional owners of the land on which this event is taking place. I pay our respects to the elders past, present and emerging. Please stand silently for our national anthem. Our calls of values after me. We show diligence, we show integrity, we show courage, and we show empathy. Please repeat our college rules after me. We are respectful, we are responsible, and we are safe. Please be seated. I would like to invite Mrs. McCann to share our student recognition and read certificates. Certificates will be given to your teachers to present to you. I'm pleased to be able to announce our Week 10 award winners. From PrEP, Georgie, always participating actively during our phonemic awareness program. Liam, for participating enthusiastically during reading groups and using his reading strategies. Lorenzo, for working so hard and doing a great job in his writing. Elijah for always being a kind and thoughtful friend. To Alex for making a great effort in the playground and using lovely manners. And to Elijah for working so well independently and working on your behaviour choices. In Year 1, Yehemi for her persistence and diligence in building her writing skills. To Violet for a positive start to her earnshaw learning journey. For Zoe, always being cheerful and getting along. And Ashaya, for persevering with daily writing to improve your sentences. In Year 2, Amaric, for his amazing effort while writing his own fairy tale. Jay, for showing diligence with his work both at school and at home. In Year 3, William, for a fantastic narrative and improvement in handwriting. Obi, always working hard to complete all tasks. From Year 4, Maya, for working diligently to complete her assessment tasks. And Chanel, for working quietly and consistently in class. To Jaskarat, for always being engaged during class and group discussions. And Raphael, for demonstrating persistence and confidence while working in class. From Year 6, Jay, for demonstrating persistence and passion for your business pitch. And Aidan, for making an amazing logo for your business assessment. Congratulations to each one of those students. Gives me great pleasure to award our reading awards this week. Over the next two weeks, we have lots of time to spend snuggling up on the couch on those cold days and enjoying reading a book. Just what I'll be doing.
from prep. Alexander, you've reached 100 nights of home reading. Amrit, also 100 nights. Congratulations in year two to Tommy and to Corbin. And in year three to Hamish, all who've read 100 nights. Well done. Our earnings for week 10 have been counted. This week's totals are Bradman on 168, Rafter on 208, and O'Neill on 217. Congratulations, O'Neill. You have earned the most points for your house this week. I would like to invite our junior school captains to draw our earning winners for this week. Winners will each receive a voucher for the top shop. So the only winner for Bradman this week is... Piper. There's no class. Piper. Congratulations, Piper. The week 10 only winner for Rafter is... Kaylee from Mr. Dolan's class. The week 10 earning winner for O'Neill is Tanisha in Miss Crank's class. Please welcome the house captain. The update for the 2020 house championship. In first place for the whole semester, O'Neill with a semester total of 6,261. The earning winner is Cassie. In second place this semester is Rafter on 5,453. And the winner is... Kate! In third place at the end of this semester is Bradman. The total points come to 4,936. And the only winner is... Tanisha. Week 10 notices. Any student turning 12 this year who would like to trial for the following sports, hockey and girls softball, please see Mr Jopic in the sports hall for details. Any student who borrows a hat at lunchtime and does not return the hat by the end of the day to the senior office will have a BSR the following day. Hats need to be returned by the student who it was loaned out to and on the same day that it was borrowed out. The environmental club is starting up bigger and better in term three. Watch this space. 10 cents containers. Place your 10 cents containers without drawers and lids in the cage near D block stairs. Thanks from the ESC Environmental Club. The end of term competition for this term will be a handball competition run at the Epitheater in lunch breaks today. Details are junior 7 to 9 competition is at lunch 1, senior 10 to 12 competition is in lunch 2, and prizes for the winners is a barbecue at second lunch for all students who participated. Only 25 participants per competition, so be quick to register. We are going to continue with our daily contest until the end of term. House points as of Friday last week are Rafter 332, O'Neill 431, and Bradman 261. Today's question is, what is the largest animal in the ocean? Email Mr. Balf with your answer. 2021 TAFE at School Applications open on Monday 13th of July, week one and term three. See your email for links to the course and price lists. If you attend, intend to apply, you should speak to Ms. Hills about getting your application started this term. Sorry to interrupt you there, Josh. I have a few extra notices for you. Firstly, the following students still need to collect their house t-shirt from the senior office, Jordana M, Ryan and K, Kellen B, Hayden D. Secondly, the tuck shop will only be open for first lunch today and closed for second lunch. And lastly, junior students will be receiving details for a family portrait opportunity in time for Father's Day. For $25 you will receive a 20 minute photo shoot and one framed portrait. Money raised will help the PNC fun lockers in the college. Thank you. I would like to invite Ms McKinnon to share an important message with you. Good morning everyone. Um, I'd like to uh, just start off by saying um, a very big thank you to our students. Although this term has been a, a rather different term, um, I'd like to thank our students for the great work that they've done and for their achievements this term. Uh, secondly, I'd like to thank our parents and our carers for being so supportive and um, helping us get through such a difficult term. 
I'd like to commend our staff at the college for their unwavering commitment uh, to the educational outcomes of the students at this college. Lastly, I'd like to wish you all a safe and happy holiday and we will see you in Term 3 on July the 13th. Thank you for attending our virtual Senior School Assembly. Have an awesome week at Earnshaw.